every day on and off the basketball court, Russell Westbrook wears a wristband on his right wrist that says KB3, something that Russell says makes him a better player and a better person. I want everybody to know about Kelsey, you know, how, how much of a great guy he was and how good he, he could be. Growing up in Los Angeles, Russell's best friend was Kelsey Bars III, who lived across the street. When they started playing ball together, that's when they became really close. They really became bonded through basketball. As high school freshmen in 2002, Russell and Kelsey made the varsity team. Kelsey, who wore number three, had an immediate impact on the court. Here goes a little freshman, you know, ninth grader, 6'6", six, six out there, you know, just beasting everybody. So he was able to hold his own and be out there as a presence as a ninth grader. They try to give it up, and that's the result. You can see Chris Jackson looking at Kelsey Bars. During their sophomore year, Kelsey averaged 18 points, 11 rebounds, and three blocks per game, as college coaches around the country took notice. Kelsey and I definitely both wanted to go to UCLA, go together and then go to the NBA. In early May 2004, Coach Reggie Morris took Russell and Kelsey to Los Angeles Southwest College to play pickup games against some of the top players in the state. Kelsey was the best player on the court even as a 10th grader. He was dominating college players. We had won like four or five games in a row. We went to go sit down over on the side and he was laughing and joking with a couple of the young guys and then he, he kind of collapsed and then took one big gasp of air and then he just fell back. When I got to the hospital, that's when his dad told me, pulled me to the side and told me that he had passed. Kelsey had died from an enlarged heart. He was just 16 years old. Russell would mourn his friend at his memorial service the following week. Basketball in heaven. Hey, Mom, do you know they have basketball in heaven? I played for the Angels on the first day. After Kelsey's death, Russell carried on for both of them, even walking across the street every morning to do Kelsey's chores before school. And his friendship with Kelsey meant a whole lot to him. You know, that he was willing to do what he had to do to help the family out to get through this traumatic moment that we were going through at the time. Russell would go on to play at UCLA, where Kelsey had wanted to play. Today, he still honors his friend. The anger he plays out there on the court, the aggressiveness Russell plays with, I think a lot of that is just that Kelsey that's in him. Russell has the KB3 bracelets, and Russell has KB3 on his shoes. What does all of that public display of support throughout the years mean? That he hasn't been forgotten, and that he'll always be remembered. That so many people loved him. I want people to know that Kelsey um, could have been the, the, the best player in the country. Kelsey's always going to be a part of my life.